Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Uh, currently fighting a cold, so bear with me, but I did not do a live stream earlier today because I am not feeling the best. But 14.5 did come out today, right here, as you can see. Uh, for iPad Voice over five, iPad OS 4. For the iPad Pro. iPad OS 14.5, Apple Inc. 4.65 gigabytes. This is going to be a big update. Learn more. Button. So we hit learn, learn more. more. And about we'll, this update. And, and I'll walk through this and then we'll do iOS at the same time. Support for separate skin tone bullet. Lit emoji lock Let's bullet. See, I'm gonna go to the top. Air tag and find my done. About this done. Air tag and find my. Alright, so air tag and find my bullet. Lit support for air tag to keep track of and find your important items like your keys, wallet, backpack, and more, privately and securely in the find my app. Bullet. Air tag can be located by playing as on via the built-in speaker. Okay, so they did do the Apple event, which I did watch, even though I was half a half alive, half dead. But all right then. Bullet. The Find My Network with hundreds of millions of devices can help you find your AirTag, even when it isn't nearby. <laughs> okay, Tom, you sounded kind of sad. Bullet. Lost mode notifies you when your AirTag is found, and you can enter a phone number where you can be contacted. List end. Okay, that's cool. Emoji. Bullet. List start. All right, here's the emojis. Support for separate skin tones for each individual and all variations of the couple kissing emoji and couple with heart emoji. Alright. Bullet. New face emojis, heart emojis, woman with a beard emoji. List end. Siri. Bullet. List start. Alright, here's Siri, which you have... Edit. Screen. Form. Links. Heading. Active. Sounds. Activities. These voices. Damon. Simone. Aaron. And Simone. Yeah, you have your typical... Aaron. Nora. Voices. Alex. No activity selected. Siri now. Bullet. List start. Siri now includes more diverse voice options. Yep. Bullet. Incoming calls can be announced with Siri, including who is calling, when you're wearing your AirPods or compatible Beats headphones, and you can answer hands-free. Oh, cool. Bullet. I didn't know that was coming. Group FaceTime calls are supported by asking Siri to FaceTime a list of contacts or a group name from messages. Oh, that's nice. Bullet. Emergency contacts can be called by asking Siri. List end. Privacy. All right. Oh, here's privacy. Bullet. App tracking transparency lets you control which apps are allowed to track your activity across other companies' apps and websites for ads or sharing with data brokers. List end. Whoopsie. Yay. Apple Music. All right, here's Apple Music. Since I actually am uh, in an Apple Music family subscription, this is going to be interesting. Bullet. Share your favorite lyrics using messages, Facebook, and Instagram stories, and subscribers can play the snippet in messages without leaving the conversation. Ah. Bullet. City charts showcase what's popular in over 100 cities from all over the world. List end. All right. Podcasts. Okay, so now podcasts. Now there is a subscription uh, for podcasts. It's kind of like YouTube Premium, but uh, I honestly don't know what to think about it. Bullet. Podcast show pages are redesigned to make it easier to start listening. All right. Bullet. Option to save and download episodes, automatically adding them to your library for quick access. Bullet. Download behavior and notification settings can be customized on a show-by-show -show basis. All right. Bullet. Top charts and popular categories in search help you discover new shows. List end. Okay. News. Bullet. Lit. Redesign News Plus tab enables Apple News Plus subscribers to quickly find, download, and manage magazine and newspaper issues. I don't have Apple News, so... Okay. This doesn't really pertain to me. All new search... Reminder. All new search experience that helps you find relevant topics, channels, and stories. List end. Right. Reminders. All right, here is reminders. Bullet. Ability to sort reminders by title, priority, due date, or creation date. Bullet. All right. Option to print your reminder lists. List end. Nice. Gaming. All right, gaming on iPad OS or iOS is meh. It, it's mediocre for me. I'm just like, meh. Apple Arcade, get out of here. Bullet. Xbox Series X Vertical Line S Wireless Controller or Sony PS5 DualSense Trademark Wireless Controller Support. List end. Alright, so if you do any gaming, there there is support for both of these. Uh, uh, fitness Plus. Controllers, and then here's Fitness Plus. Bullet. List start. Dismiss pop-up. No. This release also. Bullet. List messages at the bottom of the bullet. This re ability. Bullet. <laughs> fitness Plus. Alright, so Fitness Plus. Bullet. Lit. Ability to stream audio and video content from Apple Fitness Plus workouts to AirPlay to enable TVs and devices. List end. Alright. This release also fixes the following issues. Bullet. List start. The following issues. 
are being fixed in this update. Messages at the bottom of the thread may be hidden by the keyboard under certain circumstances. Whoops. Bullet. Deleted messages may still appear in spotlight search. Bullet. Messages may persistently fail to send texts in some threads. Bullet. Mail would not load new emails for some users until restart. Dismiss pop up. Airplane mode. Switch button. Messages may persistently fail. Bullet. Mail would not load new emails for some users until restarting the device. Ooh, I actually did not have that bug. iCloud tabs may not appear in Safari. Bullet. I bullet. iCloud keychain could be prevented from turning off. Ow. Bullet. Reminders created via Siri may be unintentionally set for early morning hours. <sighs> Whoopsie. Bullet. AirPods audio routing to incorrect device for automatic switching. Yeah, Justin was having that problem where it would switch to a different device when he got an incoming call, which would crash FaceTime calls. Hopefully that fixes that. Bullet. AirPods automatic switching notifications might be missing or duplicated. List end. Whoops. For information, HTTP empty list. So empty list. HT dismiss pop up. Dismiss Learn. that pop up. And then you can download and install it if you are on public beta or the develop if you're uh, in the developer beta portal. Uh, you can download and install it on both. And the release notes you can see by uh, tapping. Now, iPad OS 14. Dot, learn more. For him, iPad 8. Download and install. The little iPad OS 14. More. Dot, the little automatic learn updates. More button. So anyways, hope you all enjoy this video. And sorry I sound miserable. I kind of am. Uh, hope you all enjoy. Uh, and I'll see you on another video. Peace.